What is the best compliment you've received in life and why? My smile? Because <laughs> 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 it made me so happy. Thank you for saying oh, that. No problem. Kind of words are the only ones we need to speak. Good vibes in the corner here, but Kevin Neek. Good vibes in the corner here, but Kevin Neek. Karenique, welcome back to my channel, Karenique's Corner. Today, our Rants with Karenique topic is compliments. So, real quick, I want you guys to comment down below what type of person you are when it comes to compliments. Do you shy away from them? Does it make you feel awkward? Or are you one who takes it the right way? I mean, I guess there's no right way, but like one that takes it well, takes compliments well, you know, the one who can say, oh, thank you, you know what I mean, without feeling awkward or without wondering if they're lying, you know what I mean? Let me know. In the comments below the reason that i picked this topic to talk about is because i've noticed a lot lately that i've been wanting to give people compliments but my anxiety takes over and i'm just like you know what i mean like i don't do it i i scare myself out of it but really before anxiety took over my life more i used to be like super open with giving compliments like it was nothing you know what i mean if i saw it and felt it and it was genuine i gave it you know what i mean so i want to get back to being that person so i wanted to talk about it i wanted to face that and i wanted to be the person that i was before because i always remember this talk it was given in general conference i don't remember who it was by but he it always stuck with me with what he said so he was saying that it was a form of pride to deny someone a compliment that would brighten their day or make them feel good i don't know but i always thought about it. i'm like that's true I agree with that and so that always crosses my mind when I don't give the compliment that I want to give and so another thing that goes along with that and like that makes me feel like it's really true is I've had so many times and it usually not so many times I should probably calm down with that one but like I've had a couple times where I remember very distinctly and they were usually after I had given birth where I felt so insecure even though I had gotten ready too I would get ready to feel better but when I would get to wherever I was going I would be like in my head I would be like girl you you ain't it you know what I mean and it's okay to not feel yourself and it's okay to whatever but i'm saying i was really in that spot where i just really didn't feel good about myself and i kid you not the lord had my back because i was feeling so down on myself but i kid you not every single time where i had that deep ugly feeling about myself a stranger would stop me and tell me i was pretty or something like that and i literally was like what like it would brighten up my day so i'm like who am i to deny that to someone else you know what i mean if you can give a compliment and make someone else's day better a genuine compliment not just out there throwing out words for free you should do it and so i wanted to make sure that i'm still doing that and that i don't let anxiety keep me from doing that so i took it upon myself to go to people that i have been wanting to say certain things about them to whom but didn't like a compliment and i went and i told them and i kid you not before i even started that i was i was like i was hyped because i'm like it's for a video anyways like i can do this as long as i keep in my mind that it's for a video i'm gonna be able to get it done but then it came and i was like <sighs> like my insides was going and i was like i can't do it I mean, they're gonna think i'm weird they're gonna think this is dumb like they're not gonna or i'm just gonna chicken out and not do it because it's awkward but i forced myself to do it and i explained the topic and i explained why i was doing it and honestly like they loved it and they were down and they did it so i am going to share those clips with you guys i did one where i shared um a compliment with them first and then after that i asked them what their best compliment that they've ever received and why it was their favorite compliment so let's get into that so I wanted to tell you mm -hmm. that you have the prettiest smile. <laughs> okay. Thanks. And then with that, I wanted to ask you, what is the, what is the best compliment you've received in life and why? My smile? Because <laughs> <laughs> it made me so happy. Thank you for saying oh, that. No problem. <laughs> why is that your favorite compliment to receive though? Um, because it brings up my self-esteem. Aww, I love that. You're so pretty. <laughs> okay, so I'm doing a project on compliments and like genuine compliments, and I wanted to tell you that I think that you're really pretty. <laughs> and, 
<laughs> and so aside from that, I, I wanted to know what do you feel is your best compliment that you've received in life? Um, probably my smile. I get it a lot and then they always tell me I look like my mom because my smile is so Aww. <laughs> I actually really like your smile too. I'm so happy. <laughs> Thanks. So yeah. You look great, girl. <laughs> okay, so I'm doing one on compliments, and so that's like my topic that I'm going to be talking about. And I wanted to let you know that I think that you are like the most amazing person. Like, you would have never known your background because you're like so happy and kind, but like you're seriously like such a dope person. Oh, like, thank you. I love that about you. Oh, thank so, you. I wanted to also ask you for the next part. What is the best compliment you've ever received and why do you consider that your favorite or the best to get? Oh, me? Besides that one? <laughs> Man, that was awesome. Um, I, well, I recently one, had one from my boss at my other job. Um, he, he had me watch a TED Talk and about project management and in it, I was, um, the TED Talk, the guy who was doing the TED Talk talked about all of these different new things that they're doing for project management. And I wrote back to my boss and I'm like, these are all my tricks. Like, and he goes, I know, I thought of you when I, when I uh, did it. And I thought that you would be, you know, you'd like that you knew that these were things you inherently do. And <laughs> anyway, so it was just, it was very validating and a great compliment that, you know, I was doing a good job, so. That's the that. Best. You really do. You're awesome at what you do. Thank you. <laughs> so first, I wanted to say that I really admire that you embrace who you are so much and that you're not afraid to be you. And that really makes me like proud to be your friend. I'm happy that I've met you in life. And then I also wanted to ask you, what is the best compliment you feel you've received in life and why? Probably that, oh. <laughs> and I think because it helps me to see maybe who I really am. Aww, I love that. You're awesome. I hope you have a great night tonight, too. Thanks. Okay, so now that you guys have watched that, I want to challenge you guys as my viewers to go out there since I did it as well and make sure that if you have a chance to compliment someone with a genuine feeling or I want you to be able to do that for them right in someone's day and I hope that you learn to accept compliments that are given to you because you guys are all wonderful and I love you all and that's all that I have today thanks for listening to my corner Oh, and before I go as well, I want you guys to comment down below an experience that you had that maybe someone gave you a compliment and it changed your day or when you gave someone a compliment and it made you feel better or you noticed that maybe it made them feel better. I want you guys to share those experiences down below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new and welcome to all my new subscribers. Thank you so much. All right. I love you guys. Thanks for always being in my corner. The only ones you need to speak. Good vibes in the corner here, but Kevin Neek. Good vibes in the corner here, but Kevin Neek.